It's what? so beautiful. Oh what I want to do is go back to school. Thanks, I think I'm gonna keep it like this actually. You do. Uh oh, hold on. Katie, they're beautiful. We haven't had our hair done sorry, since. I'm sorry. We haven't had, look at my hair. It's like little wings. We, so we're getting our hair done together. Everybody the same lady at the same time. So we'll try to film in there first. We have to get our temperature taken. So hold on oh, a second. Bad. How are you? Good, how are you? Okay. Like, you have a hundred, so I want I to. I do. Okay. You have a what? Hundred, I was probably it's because was we're outside. running around and in the car. Oh, can you do it again in just a second? Uh-oh, hold on. All right, you guys, our temperature was high because we were sitting in the car without the air conditioning on. So anyway, it's down now. They took both of our temperatures and it's much better. So okay, we're gonna go with Jessica. Jessica's gonna take us there. Okay, bye. All right, Katie, Katie, okay. are you gonna get done, baby girl? Just my roots. Yeah? And look, cutty cut. It looks, I mean, you guys probably can't tell because you're not me, but it looks longer than it's been in the past. If you can. It is. It's a little frizzy down here, so it's good that she's actually well, a lot frizzy. Well, it's only frizzy down there because it's not curly. <laughs> right. Well, what I'm saying is she'll clean that up, which is nice, but it is longest, the longest hair you've ever had, right? Yeah, which is bad because it's not even long. <laughs> <laughs> well, compared to like Molly, whose hair is like down to here. All my friends' hair is so long. Yeah. Whatever. Okay, I like yours. Katie, they're beautiful. Thanks, I think I'm gonna keep it like this, actually. You do? Yeah, I kinda like it. I like it, too. Kinda can you futuristic, you know? You know, it's like, do you remember the movie Grease? No. Did you see the movie Grease? And they do like the beauty school dropout and everybody goes around in their foils. When I was a kid and I saw that, I'm like, I have no idea what that means. Right, like, so now I'm like, cool. yes, here we are. Oh my gosh, it's like really close to you. Oh, oh now it's like. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so we got it. Come on. Totally Your hair's grown so much. I know. It's like, like, well, it doesn't look like it now, but it is. All right, bye. I guess we'll see you after. All right. Oh, there's Katie. Look at her hair. Do you love it? The color is beautiful. I know, isn't it? It's so it. beautiful. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You like it? Katie, Jessica, you're a she is magician. Really, I've never like left here and been like. Um, I've yeah. always been so happy. With it's it. absolutely it's gorgeous. Yes. I love it. Oh, Katie, give me a little shake. There you go. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty and long. Look how long it is. Yes, I'm happy that. Yeah. I had enough healthy hair left, so I didn't have to chop it all. That's right. Love it. Oh, happy summer hair, Katie. It's Thank gorgeous. You. Thanks, Mom. I, I want her hair. <laughs> you love <laughs> <have> my hair. <laughs> you, you gave me this hair. Oh, all right. As we are leaving the salon, all right, let, here, let's see this. Now we can get our picture without the. Uh, I feel like they're not new summer dudes. I feel like they're new dudes that we happen to get in the summer. Ah. Uh, it's not like summer just started. That's a good point. So we asked Jessica when the last time was that we were here. So I was here in February. I was here in November. November, and it's now July 20th. I'm like, that's crazy. Nine? Wait, July, October, November. Wait, wait. July, August, August September, September, October. Whoa, I said July, like October, November. <laughs> yeah, that's how it goes. Perfect. <laughs> July, August, August September, September, October, October November. So for so it's eight like months, nine months or eight months. Not nine months for you, yes. No, because I thought it was the summer. So nine months for you and yeah, February, March, April, May, June, July. Five months for me. Anyway, so thank you, Jessica. All right, you guys, we are home now. And the topic of the day has been a very interesting topic of the day. Let me turn the camera around so you guys can see who we've been talking about the topic of the day with. Hold on. Here when the what did you say, baby doll? Yeah, haircuts. The, oh, well, yes, haircut. We have, well, first of all, how do you like our hair? 
You don't like it? No. Really? No, I love you. Aw, thank you, Brennan. Brennan, we think we want to take you to Jessica. Because Katie said she thinks you should get a mullet. I think you should get, you need to get the um, dead parts cut off first. No. Really? Not kind of, I was joking when I told her that. When you told her what? Jessica. It should be cut off. Oh no, I'm Try sorry. Jessica. We, Jessica's the one that did our I hair, not Jessica. your Jessica. <laughs> Jessica. <laughs> different Jessica. <laughs> did you tell her she could cut your hair? Yeah, I was like, No, our Jessica, right, Kate? You can go to our Jessica. Is she, Much older. Is she, is yeah. she at a, like a salon? Uh-huh. By herself. We followed her. The three of her salons. Yeah. We stopped her? No, wow. she when she she takes us with her when she goes. Bro. Most people do that. They, they take their clients with them. So she does great hair. She was, remember we used to get her hair cut by Beth? And then Beth stopped cutting hair. Yeah. And she cut her hair here for a little bit, but she stopped yeah. cutting hair after that. Yeah. Well, her... Uh, what do you call it? Like salon mate, <laughs> Jessica was next to her, so we we went to Jessica next, and Jessica's been doing her hair ever since, and she's very good, as you can tell by our beautiful locks. So she does guys' hair too. She does. Okay. Yes, she. Your hair would be great. So we think. I'm willing to. Uh, I'm willing to get. Uh, I told her I wanted very, very, very little cut off, like just enough to keep it healthy, and it's like. Exactly yeah, she, what she yeah, did. Yeah, exactly what I wanted. Yes. I'll so, tell her I want my sides cut off. Like, not so much that you can see my ears. But okay. Not so much that, like, there's not still, like, flow. You know, the chance yeah. flow up here. Yes. And then take some off the top, but leave the back. Maybe just trim it up. And we want to get, so this is the thing. Have you been using your um, chlorine water polo or chlorine shampoo? So, it's up here. You need to start using that. We, it just needs to be healthier. It's a little bit, um, you know. Disgusting. Yeah. No, not disgusting. It's, it's just, disgusting. But, but you have beautiful hair. It's just the ends of it right now are yucky, but you ha normally have beautiful hair. Yeah, it needs to get cut and you need to use that shampoo because you get chlorine in it every morning, but that's okay. So that's not really the topic of the day. You know what the topic of the day is? That is a, a topic of the day. This has to be one of the big topics of the day. We just discussed the not topic of the day for like 10 minutes. That's correct. Yeah, yes. That so you ready for the topic of the day? Yeah. Katie? Yeah. Do you know what it is? Um, school is canceled. Uh, yeah. So this is the deal that you guys, you want to tell everybody what's going on? Uh, so the board for our county is voting on uh, going to school virtually for the first semester. As a matter of fact, I think it's final. I think the superintendent still has to talk. To I think, yeah, the superintendent is requesting it or recommending it. What, what, every, but it's official. Like they just have to like give it their blessing, which is what they wanted to do anyway. So I will be protesting. Okay. All I want to do is go back to school. That's Said literally that. all I want to do. Like now that we can't have school, we don't want to get back. We took it for granted, didn't we? Yes. yes. Um, Brennan doesn't get to leave the student section his senior year. But listen to this, Brennan. In Florida. The school that we would go to, that Nan and Pap, um, like if we stayed like at Nan and Pap's or in their area, or move there, or move there, they are going to school. They have the option to go to school five days a week, half online, half at school, or all online. So heads will be doing online and heads will be doing half on half off. But there's also gonna be other people that are going every like five days a week, like regular school. You get and to choose. And if you want to, and if you want to change your mind along the year, isn't that crazy? The freedom of choice. Freedom of choice. <gasps> and if you want to change your mind throughout the year, you can, because it's they're following the same curriculum no matter how you're being taught. Oh my gosh, that is that's revolutionary. And, and they're doing school sports. And their fall sports are on. Like they have footballs. They're having a football season. That's revolutionary. Letting people choose for themselves. Oh man. So what do you think? So you guys, yes, that is the deal. We found out today um, that our school, and comment down below if you're in school and what your school is doing, if you're going into college or if you're in um, 
K through, <laughs> probably not kindergarten, but K through uh, senior. And even if you're in um, another country I, and your school grades are a little bit different than ours, but comment down below, please, what your school is doing. We're dying to know because it's all been very up in the air until just today when we found out that our school is going completely virtual through the first semester, which for us means through, I think, January 29th, at least. It might continue. And it's Brennan's senior year, which really stinks. And it's Ryan's freshman year, so he doesn't get to have a first day of school freshman year, which really stinks as well. And it's Kate's junior year. So let us know what you got going on. Um, trying to see our options. Our kids want to go to school, and you can't blame them for wanting to go to school. Like, it's, it really stinks. The online thing was okay, but a, well, tell me what, what do you guys think about online? Uh, uh, okay, homeschooling, really homeschooling and online public school are very different. I can tell you. Because you've done both. Done both. <laughs> Homeschooling. Ethos. Here we go. Good job. Credibility. Using my credibility. You're right. Um, it's, we can make a whole, like, a whole argument essay that uses ethos, pathos, and logos for why we should go back to school. Well, you, when you get an AP lane, you'll learn that you can't call it ethos, pathos, and logos. You just have to use. Rhetorical devices. Precisely. We learned huh? that in my English too, but like, was Miss Stewart your teacher? Yeah. That's right. <laughs> She's a big model. All right, so tell me, tell us the difference, Kate. Online, online mm -hmm. public school is like, it's like you're going, it's like regular school, except you're not at school. So you have a bunch of different, like, heads in the same class and one teacher. Heads means people. Heads means people. <laughs> and like, the, all of those people are emailing your teacher and your teacher has a hundred different students. Homeschooling, it's like you, and then like it depends on what program you guys are using, but like if you are homeschooling, mm -hmm. whatever. Mm -hmm. But I had one teacher who I would like send my tests to, and she would give me feedback, and then I had my mom who would help me, and my math brother. tutor. And your brother. And mm -hmm. so I think <laughs> it was, and it was something that I chose to do. Right. Right. So I knew what I was like. I knew. What well, I was this is the thing. I think that when people, especially last year, when people choose to go to school, they choose to go to school because they don't want to learn online. And 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 some people it worked out well. And I'm not saying it's a bad thing. Some people worked out well. But I know that you guys prefer to be to school, be at school. Well, one, I like the social interaction. Two, I like my school. Three teaches you way more actually being in the building with an actual instructor in person, like doing the work on a piece of paper instead of like having one assignment a week and typing on a computer and being like, all right. Right. So that's how it's going today. We, we found out really, about school. Like, so they're kind of bummed. Um, next generation, because no one got to go to school. Oh, I hope not. I mean, I hope not. All right, so we go, you guys, we want to hear what your school situation is. So be sure to comment down below because we want to know what's going on out there. And um, anyway, that's the topic of the day, Brennan. Uh, you know, I hope I have a senior year. I hope you do too. I hope you do too, baby. <laughs> All right, let's share what made us happy today. <laughs>